guys welcome back and today I want to talk to you about this uh, newly created um, ASICs uh, for Dory the ones that I create myself in this hot pink and I really love the color um, I am till today planning to use this uh, travelers notebook um, with the 2018 system but things may change because I usually um, very frequently change my mind and start feeling comfortable in something which is quite different. But I think that at the time, um, for the time being, this traveler's notebook um, will be satisfying my needs completely. Um, and so I will be most probably keeping it. Although I already had a setup like it in another A6 and I changed to a paper door that I've made myself which I really loved and I am loving still and I will be even posting a video about it um, because I've changed it just recently but in terms of travelers notebooks I do really really and truly um, change very very frequently what I am using I change the covers sometimes I change the inserts sometimes I go for uh, bound notebooks and just put traveler's notebooks a little bit aside. I do change a lot. Um, these are not my uh, continuous planners. I've never used them as my uh, my yearly planner and calendar like I used the Filofax ones. Those, yes, um, I always manage to stick to them and continue to use them. But as for traveler's notebooks, I just change them very frequently. But um, I wanted to film this video just to show you what I've done. This is once again um, carpet uh, material or else the parquet covering, parquet covering material. Yeah, that is what I used. And I do purchase rolls of this from uh, carpet shops. In my country these are sold in carpet shops but maybe they could be in upholstery shops I don't know I think every country comes with different types of shops depending on the product but I have made also from this uh, material the A5 the regular size and also an A4 one but this is the A6 and I really like that I've put on a white elastic band so let me open it up I've put uh, with it this big, uh, it's a big four color uh, pen and it has this woman's face colored with roses, red roses. I really like this. And when you open it up, you find the first insert that I also made myself. Everything you're going to see, um, I made actually myself. I did not purchase anything. Um, this is vellum paper. It can be used even for a uh, dashboard to attach sticky notes. And the first booklet that I've made is the Brain Dump Personal. So I like to have numerous brain dumps in my traveler's notebooks because many uh, times I just need to just jot down random notes wherever I am and having the brain dump notebooks is what simply made me uh, feel very good um, and not so much overwhelmed throughout the days, especially when I am very, very busy. So um, all I have here is a blank paper insert that I've made myself and the back part of the vellum. This is the same vellum once again because the notebook is a brain dump creative. And here is my brain dumping insert for anything that has to do with YouTube, videos, planner projects, um, recipes that I really like to collect and write and even to create myself. So anything that is not of a personal, uh, routine to do nature etc um, the next insert that I have is my to do personal and I've used this type of vellum this, this time round which has houses because many of the times my to do personals have to do with uh, house chores uh, work I have to do places I have to clean so I thought that the house uh, pictures on the vellum paper just matched perfectly then I have this time however a, a lined paper notebook and this is just 
a A6 notebook, nothing so special about it. It's normal, it has lined paper from beginning to end. Then there is the back of the vellum that I've been using. Then there is my to-do work, which is another booklet and another vellum paper. And this time the cover of this notebook is in black. And I have put into it, uh, again, another notebook like the previous one in lined paper. Then the back of the vellum, as you can see here, and then there is my to buy. And I've put hearts, a vellum paper with hearts for one reason. I love shopping, like probably many of the women out there. So um, I've put that because I love it. And I've put um, simply lined paper, uh, another lined paper notebook. And many of the times I just put um, grocery lists on the front part of the notebook and then all the other types of purchases on the back side of the notebook. What I have in here is this is has been put on elastic too and this is a pouch that I've purchased from a local stationery shop and you can put receipts in here. I think that there are plenty of A6 pouches out there that you can purchase and just attach them to your notebook and this is uh yeah this comes it's made in china but there is uh it's from france it seems it's from the brand viquel something like that and this is my a6 travelers notebook that i intend to use or else plan to use with this one here that I will also be showing you later on. So my plan so far is to have this one, which is a Filofax Domino in soft pink. Um, this will be my uh, 2018 planner with all the sections into it. I've been already working on it quite a bit and putting dividers, but it's not yet finished, as you can see there. And I intend to use it with this one, and this will be my pencil pouch for the two of them. So yeah, with this one. So this will be most probably my uh, next up system for next year, if things just don't change. So I hope that you enjoyed this video. I hope that I explained a little bit about my planners and what I intend to use for next year. Stay tuned because there will be uh, various videos about next year's system. But until then, just like vi the videos, subscribe to my channel and to my Facebook page and even to Pinterest because I'm posting even there. And until next video, take care. Bye.